You got to understand expenses and overhead. It's part of the financial picture. You can make a whole bunch of money one month profit wise and have less money in the bank on the 30th than you did on the 1st. Do you realize that? And why is that? It's called variable overhead. It's all the money flying out the door on the properties you hadn't sold yet. You start the month with 100,000. You sell two houses. You make 70, you make 35,000 each. You may not have 170 in the bank at the end of the month. You may have 62, because you got three rehabs going. Not as much now, thank goodness, but for the first seven or eight years in this business, I spent more time on cash flow than any other part of the business. Projecting out, projecting out. And my safety factor was always, if I don't have a closing for 90 days, do I have enough money to make it? If I don't have any closings for 90 days, do I have enough money? And that's the way I thought. I wasn't going to put the company in a position to go out of business. You can be equity rich and cash poor by not managing your cash flow. Cash flow is king in this business. Cash, 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 cash. That's the reason don't use your cash to buy houses. Use other people's money to buy houses. Because I say this, you can never get in trouble if you got money in the bank. Can't put yourself in harm's way if you've got money in the bank. You run out of money, you can't operate. Can't pay your bank, can't pay your light bill. 